This is a Q-Brain 4-in-1 speed controller for multi-rotors, but it could be used also for four-engine aircrafts. We will learn now how to program all speed controllers using Turnigy programming card. We have two sets of pins, one marked as battery and one as BEC. Now I will connect the first ESC that has signal and BEC wires. BEC provides plus 5 volts supply needed for the programming card. Mind the polarity, signal wire, white, is on the left. I will now connect the battery to the Q-Brain and that will power up the ESC and the programming card. The card will light up indicating current ESC settings. Pressing the left button on the card will make the first setting flashing. I can change that setting by pressing left right arrow button. I can go through all the settings pressing the left button. When I am done with settings, I press the OK button on the right, to save settings to the ESC. The card will blink the blue light to confirm the settings were successfully saved. Now, because only one ESC has BEC output and the rest of them have only signal wire, we will use this BEC to power up the card. I will connect it now to the battery input on the card. Mind the polarity, ground wire on the left, plus 5 volts in the middle. We have three ESC to program yet. Each of them has one signal wire, that I will connect to the BEC input on the card. Each ESC has to be programmed separately, it is not possible to program them all at once. Let's connect the first signal wire to the card. Please note, that signal pin is on the left. Then I will power up the ESC and wait for the card to light up. I can now set the desired settings just like I did for the first ESC. It is important to set exactly the same settings for all of the ESCs. Repeat the same process for the third and fourth speed controller. When I am done with all of them, I can install it and use it. Please, don't forget to perform the throttle calibration of all ESCs once installed in your aircraft.